Did you know that when you bite into a piece of chocolate here in Kansas City, you're determining the confections others will buy across the United States? Well, Russell Stover says we take more bites of chocolate on Valentine's Day than any other day of the year. Amy Hawley sat down with the hometown CEO. when Clara Stover came to terms with her husband's lousy ability to make a sale. He wasn't a very good salesperson and she wanted to try to help him make a sale and so the people that he gave the candy to ultimately said well why doesn't she just sell this. So she did. Mrs. Stover's bungalow candies in Denver. Kansas City based box manufacturer Lou Ward bought the company in 1960 for seven million dollars. His son Tom Ward now the CEO says the company continues to make the candies and creams just like Clara did. We actually put it in a real turkey roasting pan. Oh, really? Because that's what Clara started doing to get the heat out of the center. And we've tried to change that just because it's kind of ridiculous and found that you can't change it. And hand packing the box chocolate hasn't changed much either because about 70% of the sweet confections are irregularly shaped. It still is that way. When it goes bad, it goes really bad. <laughs> That's why um, when we have new packers, we add extra people. Today, he has the third largest chocolate manufacturer in the U.S. The company does more than a half billion dollars in sales a year. It's still family owned. We all fortunately get along. <laughs> and. That helps. They produce 2.9 billion pieces a year. He eats two a day, a taste tester of sorts to make sure they're making good tasting candy every day. The new store in Fairway is more than a retail store. It's a testing ground for new products. Ward says what Kansas Cityans buy is a good indicator of what others will buy. The number one selling flavor is his favorite, too. Pecan white. Caramel, pecans, and chocolate. And just like the good old days, the American dream can still be a sweet success. In Fairway, Amy Holly, NBC Action News. Absolutely delicious. Now, Russell Stover provides a lot of maintenance and upkeep on parts of the city, on parks and boulevards here in Kansas City, such as Loose Park, Gillum, and Ward Parkway.